Are we? Hello, my dear. Hello, my dear students. This is Sundar Rabindranathan here. Very good evening. How is everybody? Hey guys, are you able to see me, hear me very clearly? Hi, Rishab. Hi, Name. Hello, Indra. Wow, awesome, awesome. Aw amazing to see all you guys. Someone is saying what? Vanakam. Okay. <laughs> Indra. All right. SST tomorrow, exam is there tomorrow. Awesome, this quiz is gonna help you, right? So without spending more time, guys, let us move on. Today will be part one of the SST quiz, right? So this quiz is applicable for sixth grade, seventh grade, eighth grade, because I've picked questions from, you know, in such a way that all of you will get benefited. And every quiz will have questions from all three, history, geography, as well as pulse, that is political science, okay? Excellent. Bagisha, hope you're listening. Right, guys. Now, let us move on. <clears throat> hey, guys, are you liking the revision, the quick fast track revision that we are conducting? Right. So, please subscribe to the channel. We have amazing plans. Once this fast track revision is over, you will just be amazed how your vacation is going to go. You will learn a lot of skills. It's just going to be amazing. I don't want to break the suspense. Okay. So subscribe to the channel and please ensure you enable the bell icon as well. Lovely guys, lovely. Hello Choto, you can very well attend the quiz, no problem. Okay, everyone is uh, very eagerly waiting for the mentee code. Yup, all right guys, here I go to the mentee. So the code is 82340. For people who are new, you have to open another tab, type menti, go to www.menti.com, menti.com and type the code 82340. Hi Irshad, hi Tazmia. 82340. I hope you guys are getting in. Come on, come on, come on. I see a few of you have already got in. Come on guys, let us give some time. Hello, Karti. <laughs> Ankita, please don't put the questions now. It's time for me to ask the questions. Once the quiz is over, you can always put it on Telegram app. Hi, Gabru. Hello, Dhruv. Lovely, lovely to see all you guys. Guys, please don't mind. I am just uh, allowing you a minute, one minute time for everyone to just come in and join us. Okay? So that we can, once, you got it? Vijay Lakshmi, oh Kishan. All right, Meera Shailu. Awesome guys, so many of you are joining. Ra, okay, some name I just missed. They are joining guys, I still see that. Uh, who is that there? I'm not ignoring, come on. <coughs> Deir Bandari, I am very much watching you. Excellent guys. Hi Vai Bhai Vi, I am fine. So I am just waiting for, see people are still joining in. So let's allow them a minute. Come on, come on, come on. They are picking it up. They are into the system now. Is everyone joining? Okay, I think it is time that we start now. Hi Navya, I am fine, I am fine. Right guys, let us move on to the quiz. Is everyone geared up? Please still give me a yo or a yes so that we can start the quiz. Come on, come on, come on. Hi Nagacharan. Amazing guys, amazing. All right, we are going to start. That's question number one. I'm gonna start the quiz. <clears throat> so, waiting for all of you to join in. Let's see how many of you join in now. Okay, the number exactly is standing at 102, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Come on, come on, come on. All right, guys, amazing. Let me start the quiz. I hope all of you are ready for the first question. 
Okay? So let me start the first question. Here we go. I hope all you guys are doing your exams really well before I start. Right? Are these uh, the fast track revision quizzes helping you guys? It's very important because we are doing it for you. Okay, let me start guys. <coughs> Here is the question. Question number one. Name the place where Ashoka's pillar is located. Come on, come on, come on. Time is running. Name the place where Ashoka's pillar is located. So how it's okay. So what? It's knowledge. All right, I think uh, almost every one of you are geared up and answering. Last five seconds. So let me see how many of you got it right. Time is up. Wow. 83% of you got it right. Sarnath. Sarnath is the right answer, guys. Superb. Excellent, guys. Excellent. Let me see who did it fast and who has scored the maximum points. The leaderboard on your screen now. <clears throat> come on, come on, come on. Booth Hayabai, who is that? Second one is Gaurav, Aritra, Abhinav, Soham. Good guys, good, good, good going. Let us move on to question number two now. Here we go. Question number two on your screens now. Mediterranean regions are also known as, or known as, one, large fodder land of the world, two, rice bowl of the world, three, taiga region, four, orchards of the world. Choto, did you type www.menti.com properly? It should open. Okay, last eight seconds. Guys, still many have not responded. Come on, come on, come on. Quick, three, two, one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Oh, ho. only 21% of you. It's an important question. Mediterranean regions are, of the world are called as orchards of the world. Okay. Please remember that. Guys, I hope all of you are clear. Vinay, good job. Trishula, it's fine. It's okay. If you got it right, learn it now. It's important for you guys. Okay. So shall I move on to the third question? Mohit, I hope you are ready now. Here we go. Question number three on your screens now. Okay, before that the leaderboard. Who is topping now? Our, okay, Akarsha, you have come to the top. Excellent. What is the name? Hey. Incredible mind. Radhika, Srivastava and Vasu, top five. Well done guys, well done. So let us move on to see how things go. Here we go. <clears throat> Question number. The first cotton mill in India was established in which place? Madras, West Bengal, Bombay, Gujarat. <clears throat> Trishula, please type it on Menti. If you are very sure, please type it on Menti. Senthil, I hope you are listening. Last five seconds, guys. Come on, come on, come on. Faster, faster, faster. All right, time is up. 51% of you got it right. It is Bombay. Remember, Bombay is where cotton grows. They have that black soil. Remember, Maharashtra and Gujarat. So that is the reason. So that is the reason cotton mills were the first one was uh, started in India. In Bombay. Next question guys, before that the leaderboard. Is there any change in the leaderboard now? Come on. Vasu has stopped the list now. Guys, this is awesome. Amazing competition. Come on, come on guys. Vasu, Radhika is in second. Incredible mind, Neha, Nishi, Ayushman, five, top five. Excellent, guys. Let us move on. Next question on your screens. Now, 
Which of the following are iron tools? Tools made of iron. Sickle, tongs, axe, all of the above. Senthal, what are you not getting? You're not getting the quiz? You're not able to open it? Come on guys, last five seconds now. Hey guys, many of you have not responded. Come on, come on, come on. All right, 81% of you, smart work. You got it right. All of them are iron tools. Okay, sickle, tongs, all of them are iron tools. Axe, all of them are iron tools. Okay, lead about now. Sight not opening. Guys, there is no way it can happen. Let us see who is topping the list. Vasu, still at the top. Incredible mind, second, Radhika, Ayushman and Ganesh. Wow, awesome. Next question. On your screen, now. The caravan of the Banjaras are called what? The caravan of the Banjaras are called what? Is it Thanda? Is it Radha? Is it Burajis? Or none of them? Come on, guys. Sentil, are you just typing men menti.com? Are you, are you typing properly www.menti.com? Some problem at your end, please check it. Okay. 36% of you got it right, guys. It's called the Thanda. Thanda. Okay. That is the caravan of the Banjaras. Okay. Now, quickly, let's look at the leaderboard. Is Vasu still at the top? Or is there any change? Oh, Vasu is still at the top. Radhika, Ganesh Raj, unbeatable Indra. Wow. Okay. Right, guys. Leader, leaderboard is done. Next question now on the screen. Mahatma Gandhi felt that, fill in the blanks, this ought to be the medium of teaching. Is it Sanskrit? Is it Hindi? Is it Indian languages? Or is it English? Mohit, it will happen. Don't worry. Tricky question. Everyone is thinking now. Yeah? Good, guys. Good, good, good. Quick, quick, quick. Time's running. Last five seconds. Many of you have not responded. Quick, quick, quick. Time is up. All right. Wow. 39% of you got it right. Mahatma Gandhi said education should happen in our languages. Our own native Indian languages. Okay. Okay. Now what does the leaderboard say? Unbeatable Indra. Indra stopping the list now. Wow. <clears throat> Indra twice. What are you doing? Using two different IDs. Pra then Royce Vasu. Awesome guys. Awesome. Let us move on. Next question. <clears throat> the uppermost solid layer of the earth is called what? Is it biosphere? Hydrosphere? Atmosphere or lithosphere? Beta Choto, I am not able to help you because I am not able to understand what is the problem. Because everyone is able to open it. The site is opening for everyone. You have to check, check the help of someone who is around you. Please. Last five seconds, guys. <coughs> Abhijit, you want to learn French? Okay, 60% of you got it right. Alright, the uppermost layer, the solid layer of the earth is called lithosphere. Right? So, I hope everyone is clear. Once who got it wrong, please remember now. Excellent. Leaderboard now. <coughs> so, is still Indra still at the top? 
Wow! Awesome! No change! Awesome guys! Roy, Vasu, Radhika, come on guys, compete! You guys are very, very close! All of you are doing amazingly well! Indra, Roy, everyone! Next question! Delhi under Shah Jahan was called what? Is it called as Chandni Chowk? Or is it called Shah Jahanabad? Or is it, was it called both Chandni Chowk and Shah Jahanabad? Or no, none of this. Guys, many have not responded. Come on, come on. Move fast. Time's running. Last seven seconds. Quick, 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 quick. It's not moving. The needle is still not moving. Oh, Stein is up. 70% of you got it right, guys. Amazing. It is called as Shah Jahanabad. The name suggests it all. Under the rule of Shah Jahan, it was called Shah Jahanabad. Right? Excellent. Leaderboard now. What does the leaderboard say? <coughs> okay. Any change? Roy is stopping the list now. Indra is in second. Vasu is in third. Karun is in fourth. And again, the second one, Indra is in fifth. <coughs> there, let me work it out. Give me some time. Okay, guys, next question. See, guys, you, as I, I hope you understand now all these things are taken from your syllabus. Be on it now. Brahma Samaj was founded by whom? Was it Vivekananda? Was it Dayanand Saraswati? Was it uh, Ishwar Chandra Vidyasagar? Or was it Rajaram Mohan Roy? Brahma Samaj. Who founded Brahma Samaj? That is the question. Hmm. Guys, many of you have not responded. Come on. 4, 3, 2, 1. Time is up. 55% got it right. It's a simple question. Trust me. It was undoubtedly Raja Ram Mohan Roy. Okay. So Brahma Samaj was founded by Raja Ram Mohan Roy. Now the leaderboard. Is there any change? Is Royce at the top now? Is there any change? Wow. Royce is still at the top. Indra is very close. Vasu. So is Vasu and Karun. Well done guys. And unbeatable Indra again. Next question guys on your screen now. Come on. Let's look at the question. Which plateau is called the Peninsular Plateau? Which plateau is called the Peninsular Plateau? Come on guys, come on. Push yourself, push yourself. 20 seconds more, push yourself. Is it Tibetan? Is it Deccan Plateau? Is it Chota Nagpur? Is it North? Guys, many have not responded. Only 114 of you have responded. Quick, time is running. Time is running, guys. Okay, 71% of you got it. It's a simple question again. Peninsula Plateau is undoubtedly, it's so simple. It's a Deccan Plateau. Right? Leaderboard now. Guys, I hope you guys are enjoying the question. These questions are interesting from the syllabus and asked in the question paper. Okay, Indra back to one, Royce in number two, Vasu three, Karun four, again the second version of Indra five. Let us see where we stand now. Question, River Nile is located in which place? Was it in Africa, America, Asia? No, none of the above. Hanshi, don't cry, it's okay. Guys, many have not responded. Moving very slow. Come on, come on, come on, guys. Push yourself, make it fast. Okay, 72% of you see, guys, simple question. It is in Africa. How can you miss this? You cannot. 71, 72% of you got it right. Yeah? 
Nile River is in Africa. Next question. All right, leaderboard. Before that, any change in the leaderboard? Is Indra is at the top now? Indra is still at the top, I believe. Indra, Roy, Vasu, Karun, no difference. Guys, next question on your screen now. Which crop is also called as the golden fiber? Wow, simple question. I don't want you to, no one should miss this. Which crop is also called the golden fiber? Is it wheat, millets, jute, maize? Twelve more seconds. Come on, come on, come on. <coughs> come on, guys. Time is up now. It is jute, right? How many of you got jute right? 63% of you got right. Jute. With the color shine of it itself, you can say that it's the golden fiber. It's so lux, you know, the luster is so high. Yes, Mitar, Mitar Ajani, you will find that questions will come from history, geography, as well as political science. All three I have mixed in the quiz. It is SST, right? Okay, now, leaderboard. Any change, any change, any change? All right, both are competing very well. Indra, Royce, very close. Awesome. Yeah, we are getting close towards the end. Sanjay, don't worry. <clears throat> India is situated in which hemisphere? Simple, but very important question. Eastern, Western, Southern, Northern. <clears throat> come on, 10 more seconds. Come on, guys. Come on, come on, come on. It's stuck at 120. Come on. Okay, time is up. Still 120. All right. 59% of you got it right. It is in the northern hemisphere. So I saw a few of you are typing southern hemisphere. Not at all. Uh, it is very clearly in the northern hemisphere. Okay, what does the leaderboard say now? Is there a change? I think there is. Rice, Vasu, Karun, Indra suddenly moved to four. Come on, come on, guys. Wow, this is amazing. Excellent competition happening, guys. So, coast of Florida is in which place? Coast of Florida is in Brazil, Canada, U United States, Canada, Japan. Is it? Coast of Florida is in Brazil, United States, Canada, Japan. Guys, we are moving towards the uh, you know towards the closure of the quiz. Come on, come on, come on, guys! Five more seconds. Quick, 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 quick! Oh no, 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 no! Just time is up. So, United States, fifty-eight percent of you got it right. Well done, guys. Well done. <clears throat> Florida, guys. Florida is one of the states of the US, right? So you can't miss it. The question is a bit deceiving because I put it as coast of Florida. Okay. So. Hmm. Rice is, I think, still. Oh, Wasu has come to the top. Wow, Vasu, Royce, Karun, Indra, Raja, Rocks. These are the top five. I think we are moving towards the last part of the quiz. The Chief Justice gets retired at which age? Is it 45, 56, 58, 65? Which age, what age the Chief Justice gets retired? Dhruv, is it easy? Come on. Pick yourself up. Answer there. Another five more seconds, guys. Last five seconds. 
Come on, come on. I think Vasu is stopping now, right? 58% of you got it right. It is the age of 65 when Chief Justice retires. All right. Amazing, guys. Amazing. Now, where do we stand? Who is stopping? Okay, I think Vasu is still topping the list. <coughs> Vasu at the top. Wow. <coughs> Amazing, guys. Well done. Well done, everybody. Vasu, many congratulations. Guys, many of you. Vasu, Indra, Royce, Karun. Okay, <laughs> very heavy competition. Excellent. I hope you guys really like the quiz. More importantly, these are exam related questions for 6th grade, 7th grade and 8th grades. All three club together. And this is not this is just part one, guys. You will find a lot of important things coming in. Right, guys. So just to enjoy all the quizzes, the further quizzes, vacation plans, sprints that are coming in, please ensure all you guys subscribe to the channel without fail, enable the bell icon. And of course, if you like the questions, please hit the like button. All right. Excellent, my dear students. It was lovely, lovely interacting with all of you. Please put in your comments in the comment box. If you need any kind of videos also, we can prepare them depending on how many of you are asking for it. If we feel it is important and interesting, definitely we will make them for you. Yeah. So do not worry. I think all of you deserve a big round of applause. You guys did an amazing job. All right. So thank you so much, my dear students. It was lovely interacting to, with all of you. All right. So <clears throat> until I meet all of you in the next video, this is myself Sundar Ravindranathan signing off guys. Have a wonderful evening. Bye bye.